breakfast for me. Oh wait. Just taking care of my brother. He's got pneumonia and can't go to the doctors. Cause it's just too much money. We don't we don't have any money to pay them. I guess I have to make my own food now. Hi mom, how is he doing? Is he better? <sighs> Honestly, I I don't know. I think I think he is. I don't know what to do anymore. We can't afford medicine and we can't afford a doctor's visit. So we're just basically on our own. But he <laughs> I, I don't want him to die. I know, and we just gotta keep doing what we're doing because we just can't stop. <laughs> well, I'm hungry, so uh, if you don't need any help, uh, just tell me, okay? I don't want my brother to die. I just, <laughs> I can't imagine a day or any day being alone without him. <sighs> I need to figure out a way to make money so that we can pay for a medicine. I just, I can't just stand here and do nothing. It makes me feel completely helpless that I can't do anything to, I can't do anything to help him. <sighs> I just wish there was a, something or a way to, Help him. I just, I wish. <laughs> oh, I forgot. We haven't been to the grocery store in a while. We just have lemonade and eggs and muffins. Wait, wait a second. I, I know what I can do. If I make lemonade, I know we have a tree outside with lemons. So. If I can get a bunch of lemons, then then I could make some lemonade, and then I could just have a lemonade stand. And I'm sure that would be enough money to buy medicine or something. That's perfect. Okay, I'll just grab this lemonade and grab some sugar in the cabinet. Grab the lemonade. There you go. And then close the door. This is perfect because I have a lemonade stand outside from a long time ago. And I have lemons, lemonade, and cups. I just need to grab cups from the attic, and that's it. Oh my gosh, that's perfect. It's gonna work out so well. Okay, let's get started. So I have a full day of work. <laughs> okay, just need to open the door. Okay, perfect, now just go inside. And, oh, I gotta go, whoopsies. Wait a second. This is perfect. I can use this as decor. And it'll attract more shoppers and stuff. Yes, this would be perfect. Okay, just need to grab this and take it outside. Okay, Okay. perfect. Now I just need to get the big stand. Oh, and cups, that's right. Okay. Uh. Oh, perfect. Okay, everything is done. Now I just need to wait for customers. Yes. Winter? What are you doing? Oh, hey, Joey. Oh, I'm doing a lemonade stand so I can make money for my brother, so he can buy some medicine. Wow, that's really nice of you. Huh, how much is it? I'll buy one. It's only $2 for lemonade and then uh, $3 for the ones to go. Oh, sweet, okay. Uh, I'll get the green one over there in the back of the lemonade, please. Coming right up, sir. <laughs> oh, uh, well, you see, I kind of came over here for a reason, um, and that was because I wanted to give you a note, and there's some money in there to pay. Here you go. I hope it helps your brother. Oh, wow. Thanks, Joey. You're so nice. Mm -hmm. No problem. <laughs> Ooh, this is some really good lemonade. Huh, I love it so much. Mmm, delicious. <laughs> You wouldn't mind if I stuck around and helped you out, right? I mean, I don't care about getting the money or anything. I just want to hang out. No, I don't mind at all. I think that would be great, actually. 
Here, let me get uh, that seat out of the way. And we can just stand behind it when someone comes, obviously. Mmm, <laughs> this lemonade is really good. You did a great job making it. Thanks! It kind of includes all of the ingredients on the back of this lemonade that's, that was already made. So I kind of just copied it and put a little twist of my own in it. I'm glad you like it though. I really like cooking and baking and all that stuff, but we never really had the money to just buy a bunch of ingredients and for me to mess around and try to create something with it. So, yeah. Aw, you should come to my house. My grandma is always making stuff. She's always making like pastas and pizzas and all types of stuff. And she would really enjoy another person being there with me to cook all the cool stuff that she's got. Really? Oh my gosh, that would be so awesome. I would love that. Awesome. I'll ask her if you can hang out tomorrow and we can make something. That would be so much fun. Yeah, totally. I would get out of the way just in case some people come because I don't want to be in the way. <laughs> well, well, well. Would you look at this, Karen? Oh my gosh, they're such babies. <laughs> wow, so pathetic. They have to make their money by doing a lemonade stand. How dumb is that? <laughs> oh my gosh, so pathetic. Uh, what do you want? Hmm, nothing. I just like being here and talking to you guys. <laughs> right, Karen? No, you don't. You said you don't like being with them and that they're really annoying. Oh my gosh, be quiet, Karen. You don't, you're just so dumb. Like, I don't, sometimes I wonder why you're my friend. <sighs> Whatever. Well, unlike you, Sunny, I'm trying to make money for a good cause. You just get money for free because your parents are rich and you can just do whatever you want. Well, if you're gonna talk like that to me, you better think twice because I will make your life miserable and I will never, ever hesitate about it. I don't have time for this, okay? I'm just trying to make money so that I can help my brother, who has pneumonia, by the way, and I don't think you even care because you're just a cold-hearted person. So, yeah. Why don't you go bother somebody else? I don't have the time for you right now. Oh, that's unfortunate. <laughs> I mean, you are poor after all. Like, your parents cannot afford anything. <laughs> I mean, they are pretty poor, if you really think about it, but... No, I'll just leave you alone since you asked for it because, yeah, your brother's sick and whatever and nobody cares about him or you. So, bye. Wait, can I get one? Huh? Come on, Karen, let's go. Uh, well, I'll see you around. I, I would have bought one, but you know her. She's, she's going to be mad at me, so I got to go. Uh, bye, good luck. Winter, I don't understand. Why don't you stand up to her? Like, she's, she's just a brat, a spoiled rich brat. You should stand up to her. It's not okay that you get bullied like this consistently. Oh yeah, Joey? Well, thanks for the advice, but I didn't see you doing anything. <gasps> Look, I'm sorry. It's just, I thought you were ready to pick that battle, but I guess you weren't, so I didn't really stand up for you. I just, I just thought you had it, that you, got it under control, but I, I guess not. <sighs> it's fine. Look, just the reason why I don't pick those battles is because I don't want to make things worse. I don't want her to make my life even worse than it is now. And, you know, sometimes I just ignore her and pretend she's not there. I mean, I'm not saying it's bad or anything, but like, she's just that really annoying little fly that you can't seem to get rid of. But don't you tell your parents? What? No, I, I don't tell my parents. <sighs> if I told my parents, it just, I don't know. It just, I can't. Wait, you don't tell your parents? Why not? Look, Joey, the reason why I don't tell my parents is because one, my dad is working 24 seven with his two jobs and never has time to stay home and at least do one thing with us. And two, my mom is currently busy 24-7 trying to take care of my brother who was sick, okay? And it's not just a little cold that we can easily get rid of, it's pneumonia, okay? So do you see why I can't tell them? Because they're busy, worried, and working hard to provide for this family. Like, see, if you don't try, then what's the point? If you don't ever try, then you won't know that it, that they'll help you. But if you're consistently just 
acting like your day is fine, then there, there's a problem. Because if there's something that's really bothering you, you might as well tell them. Okay, mom, whatever. It's just, I can't. You just don't understand, but I can't, okay? So let's just talk about something else. I'm sick of the subject. Okay, fine. Hello. Oh, hello, sir. Would you like some lemonade? Actually, no. I'm here to make a business proposition. A business proposition? But what are you going to offer? I don't have much. Well, you see, my proposition is that you sell all of the lemonade that you have here to me and I'll give you $10,000. <laughs> Wait, what? Uh, uh, hold on, hold on. Wait, you're, you're kidding, right? This is a prank, right? Right? There's no way that my stuff costs that much. It's just, don't you just wanna pay like the regular price? I, I don't understand, why are you giving me $10,000? Well, you see, I'm a man with a lot of money and um, I was in a certain spot long, long ago where you kind of are and I was struggling a lot and I used that money to help my family and I heard about what happened to you and so what I wanted to do was kind of help you out. So uh, here is the $10,000, it's on a check, but I hope it's enough to help you out and uh, I hope that you say yes. Oh my gosh, yes, I. this, this is perfect. This will help my brother and oh my gosh, thank you so much. This means a lot. I, I don't know how to say thank you. This is so much money. And I just, I don't know. Oh no, you don't have to thank me at all. I mean, you could thank me about one thing, which is it's quite hot out here. So maybe a little bit of lemonade would do. Oh my gosh, yes, uh, take take all of it. I, I still have a couple of bottles left. Uh, here, here's one and I'll get the other ones. <laughs> here you go. Oh, thank you. Well, I hope you have a great rest of your day and you as well. Um. Yeah, thank you for the lemonade, and I hope that this $10,000 will help. Uh, let me grab the other lemonade here. <laughs> and there's some, there we go. Well, I'll see you later. Thank you, bye. There's no way that this is real. There's no way. But it, it is real. This is insane. Wow, that's so cool. You... Wow, I just, I don't know what to say about that. That's super awesome, Winter. I hope that helps. Should we clean up now? Oh, right, about that. I uh, will put this over here. All right, let's clean up. 